back to the Necro Zoo. I am Bones, and in this one, I'm going to show you something I picked up at a pawn shop. A pretty cool find. Um, let's get into it. So, what I did end up picking up was the Friday the 13th Ultimate Collection tin. Now, uh, I did get this at the pawn shop. I had a picture of where, when I was at work and on uh, lunch break, I just stopped at a pawn shop and I found it. But this is, uh, I've been holding on to this for a while and I wanted to crack it open and see what's inside. It, it does still have the J card, but I don't think this is sealed because I think they just like resealed it. So I, I don't really care because I do own uh, both of the things that come in here, which is the uh, Crystal Lake to Manhattan collection and the tin. These are my uh, original ones. But as I said, uh, I bought these. It does say uh, 65, but I asked the guy if he'd take 60. And he said, yeah, because I go in there all the time. But it did end up coming out to about 64 bucks. So uh, let's crack this open and see if it has everything inside or what's going on. Because, uh, like I said, they're still sealed. So let's open it up. All right, guys, like I said, been holding on to these for a while, so let's crack into them. I'm not going to open this one because uh, there's not much to it. As long as all the discs are in there, you know, it's pretty good. But uh, the reason you would want to have this uh, in your collection is because this, as I said before, this is the only place where you could find the commentary for part three, which is an awesome, awesome part in the series um i love part three um richard brooker as jason is just awesome i mean he's like really powerful uh, terrifying and um uh, he just gave, gave like a real powerful but at the same time uh like uh elegant uh performance as uh jason of course this is also the first time we see jason with the iconic uh hockey mask so like I said, I always love part three. Uh, I saw it when I was really young and, and uh, I couldn't sleep for a couple of, of weeks. So uh, that's why Richard Brooker has always been my my favorite Jason. I mean, the, the thing is that it, since he was more real, like it seemed to me like he could actually come after me and stuff. But later on when he became zombie Jason, of course, it was just like, yeah, like, you know. Uh, not to take anything away from Kane Hodder, I, I do love the, all, I love all the series of, of Friday the 13th, but uh, just Richard Brooker always stands out uh, as an awesome Jason, uh, R.I.P. Um, like I said, of course, in here you get the commentary for part three. It's not in the Blu-rays, it's not uh, anywhere else. You have to have this collection. Um, you get, of course, you get a... Uh, Who's in the commentary? You have that uh, uh, Shelly, Larry Zavka. You have uh, uh, Paul Kratka, um, uh, Rick. You also have uh, the lead, um, Chris, Dana Kimmel. And of course, you have Richard Brooker in there who played an awesome, awesome Jason. So like I said, I'm going to leave this one sealed. I already own this, but... Uh, I might, I don't know what I'll do with this. I might uh, sell it on eBay or uh, trade it at some time. Or, I'm not sure. But now this, uh, 
I'm kind of interested to open this because I think it's just sealed a bit like by the pawn shop. So I'm really <laughs> interested to open it and see if it has everything complete inside. Uh, ah, I'm just gonna open. Like I said, I already have my own, so it's not a big deal. But uh, let's get into it. Okay, guys, so let's see what we got. Like I said, there is the J card. Pretty cool that someone kept that with it. I don't even think I have mine, but uh, let's open it up. Looks looks pretty much brand new. Um, of course, there's a digital code. I don't know if they've used that or not, but let's find out. Um, of course, you get the the book. Now what I'm really interested to see, if you still have the patch and the glasses. Uh, yeah, there you go. There's the patch, there's the glasses. Of course you have all the movies in here from part one uh, all the way to Manhattan. And you also have uh, Jason Goes to Hell, which the only way you could actually see the unrated version is on some blu-rays that are out there uh in in blu-ray i think the digital the digital might have the unrated version uh you have jason x you have uh the remake with another awesome jason played by Dirk mears uh, it's pretty cool that everything's in here pretty cool find i mean right now this is going online for like at least a hundred bucks um you might get lucky i don't know but the last time i saw one sell it was like 150 bucks so you still have this pretty cool uh you're all doomed little rubber strap thing um, like I said, this does have the digital codes, but I'm not sure if it's good. It looks like it's brand new, so I mean, I don't see why it'd not be good, but it's in there. Well, like I said, this is the ultimate, ultimate collection of Friday the 13th, uh, matched up with the, the Lake to Manhattan. Awesome, awesome finds at the pawn shop. All right, guys, so uh, I'm gonna hold on to those in the collection. Um, as I said, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with them. I might end up selling it on eBay or if I get to 300 subs, I might make that 10 one of the prizes, but uh, we'll find out. I'm not really too uh, worried about it, but thanks for watching, guys. See you on the next one.